Hello lovelies. All right. I am starting with a clean face and then I am taking the e.l.f. Perlis primer and applying that all over my face. Next, I am taking my NYX Total Control Drop Foundation and I am applying that with a beauty blender, just squeezing it directly onto the beauty blender and then applying it to my face. For concealer, I am taking the Too Faced Born This Way concealer and I am applying that underneath my eyes, onto my lids, as well as various highlight points and points where I want more coverage. Then I am taking the NYX HGG eyeshadow primer and I am applying that to my lids as well as underneath my lower lash line. Then to set everything, I am taking the Essence All About Matte Setting Powder in a fluffy brush and I am applying that all over my face. For my brows, I am first taking a spoolie and brushing them in a more orderly direction. And then for my brows and my lids, I am taking the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette in a slightly softer angled brush. And I am going to grab Sixpresso and brush that through my brows. And I am distributing it with the little spoolie to make it a little more natural looking and kind of like there are actual brow hairs being added slash that my eyebrows are naturally that color. Then for eyeshadow, I am starting with the shade Nudie and I am very lightly sweeping that all over my lids as sort of a base shade, just to kind of get some color down on my lids. Then I am taking the shade Strapless and I am blending that into my crease and when I say blending, I mean blending a lot. Like fluff this out till your heart's content. Then to add some warmth to my lids, I am taking a little bit of honey butter and I am just kind of patting that over the other shade. For the brow bond highlight, I am taking the shade Heaven and gently sweeping that under my brows. Now, instead of actually doing liner, because Wonder Woman doesn't actually have any, I am dipping the brush I use for my eyebrows into Sixpresso and Risque, and I am sort of smudging that into my lash line very, very gently, more actually towards the lashes themselves, just to give it a little more dimension and make my lashes look fuller. For mascara, I am grabbing the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara and applying generous coats to make my lashes lovely and long. Then for contour, I am taking an angled brush and nudie and applying it to the hollows of my cheeks, sort of stopping at the midpoint and contouring under my, the apples of my cheeks to kind of make my face look more round and feminine, as well as contouring a little bit in a point shape towards my chin instead of the usual way I contour. Then for lush, since 
that is the only quote unquote obvious makeup that she seems to be seen wearing. I am taking the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush in the shade Party in a fluffy brush and applying that heavily to the apples of my cheeks in a upward motion. Then I'm grabbing a fluffy brush and blending out the blush and my contour. For a very subtle highlight, I am taking the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighter in Precious Petals and applying that to the high points of my cheekbones, down the bridge of my nose, and to my cupid's bow. For my lips, I am grabbing the NARS Satin Lip Pencil in the shade Rikujin and applying that to my lips, drawing over just a little bit. And this is the finished look. This was awesome. Yeah, my bracers are kind of missing, but you know what? Hey, I've been wanting to do this since I saw the movie and just... I can't even begin to say how much Wonder Woman means to me. She's just, like, my favorite, and I love her. But this is a lot of fun, and if you like my shenanigans, do feel free to subscribe. But as usual, all the helpful links are in the description below. I love you guys dearly, and I'll see you next time. Bye!